Today, I'm going to be sharing my guide for novices on the different koi varieties. All koi with silver scales start their name with Ginrin. For example, Ginrin Kohaku, Ginrin Showa, or Ginrin Chagoi. Koi can be divided into two categories, Wagoi, which is fully scaled koi, and Doitsu, which has leathery skin and few scales. Most Doitsu koi start their name with Doitsu, for example Doitsu Showa, Doitsu Kohaku, or Doitsu Sanke. So first let's start with Kohaku. Kohaku is a white koi with red markings on top of it. Sanke is a white koi with red and black markings. You also get a metallic Sanke called Yamato Nishiki. Showa is a black koi with red and white markings. Metallic Showa are called Kin Showa. A white koi with red markings with black edging on the scales is called a Kuromo. A koi with blue scales on top and an orange belly is called an Asagi. A completely black koi is called a Karasugoi. A black koi with white fin tips is called a Hajiro. A black koi with white head and fin tips is called a Hageshiro. A black and white koi with doitsu scales is called a kumonryu. A metallic kumonryu is called a kikokuryu. A kumonryu with red in it is called a beni kumonryu. And a metallic beni kumonryu is called a beni kikokuryu. A completely red or orange koi is called a beni goi. A red koi with white fin tips is called an akahajiro. Green koi are called midori goi. A yellow koi is called a kigoi. And a mustard yellow, sometimes even pink koi, is called karashi goi. Then it's on to the Utsuri. Yellow ones are called Ki Utsuri, red ones are called Hi Utsuri, white ones are called Shiro Utsuri, then on rare instances you even get a brown Utsuri called a Cha Utsuri. Metallic yellow Utsuri are called Kin Ki Utsuri, platinum white Utsuri are called Ginshiro Utsuri, and metallic red Utsuri are called Kin Hi Utsuri. Then there is the Beko. You get Akabeko, Shiro Beko, and Ki Beko. A metallic yellow beko is called a tora ogon and a metallic white beko is called a gin beko. Then there is the ogons. A metallic white koi is called a platinum ogon and a metallic yellow koi is called a yamabuki ogon. A metallic orange koi is called an orangey ogon and a metallic grey koi is called a nezu ogon. A brown koi is called a chagoi and a grey koi is called a soragoi and a koi with both grey and brown markings is called a nochiba shigure. A grey koi with red markings is called a goshiki. A koi with black pinecone pattern on its scales is called matsuba. Red ones are called akamatsuba and yellow ones are called ki matsuba. You also get a metallic yellow one called a kin matsuba and a metallic white one called gin matsuba. A metallic white koi with orange markings and a black pinecone pattern is called a kujaku. You also get doitsu kujaku. Then there is the yellow variety called a kirin. Metallic doitsu with red and white markings is called a kikisui. A doitsu with blue and red markings is called a shushui. A metallic white doitsu with orange and black markings is called a hesai nishiki, but it is sometimes referred to as a doitsu yamato nishiki. A white metallic koi with yellow markings is called a yamabuki harewake or lemon harewake. Now of course I didn't go into too much detail on all the different varieties that you get, but this list should give you a basic introduction. 